Hi guys, what's up, Jason here, and welcome back to a brand new FIFA 18 player review on my channel. And in today's video, guys, I'm going to be reviewing 82 rated Inform Tuper Motang. Now, this guy's got a huge upgrade from his normal card, especially in the dribbling stats. As you can see, this guy's got 95 dribbling as his in game stat, and as well as that, he's also really tall and got decent acceleration stats, decent shooting stats, and decent passing stats. So, getting to this guy's first pro now, what is his height? Now, as you can already tell, probably just from looking at this card, this guy is very, very tall, and the whole phys physique of his body, um, you know, the way he looks in game is just really, really cool. I think, you know, that's one of the reasons he plays so good, is just because he looks so big on the pitch, and you know, it sort of scares opponents away. And it's also very easy to find him as well, just because how tall he is, um, you know, so it's really good on those counter attack um, opportunities, you know, where you can just automatically know that he's making the run and just play the three ball straight to him. And then the next pro I could find with this card was his dribbling. Now this guy has a 95 dribbling. Um, on his normal card he has around 80 dribbling. But on this card he got a huge upgrade. Um, I'm not really sure why he's got his inform. But I might research it later. And um, tell you guys in the comment section below. Because it must have been like a really good run or something. To get such a big um, upgrade on the dribbling category. And then the final pro I could find with this card was his strength. Now this guy has 85 strength. What is incredible. Um, especially for a fast player. Um, this guy has around 85 pace, what is really good, and he's also strong, and that's really rare on FIFA to find a player with really good strength and really good pace, and I think, you know, when those two things do come together, you have yourself a very, very good player. So this guy has 95 dribbling as his key stats, he has medium low work rates, what isn't the best for a winger, but to be honest, I didn't really seem to find it a con. And what I'd recommend to do with this card is actually in-game move him to the striker position because that's where I played him for the majority of the matches. I found on the wing he was a little bit isolated so I moved him into the striker position and then he started to um, play very, very well for me. And then as well as that he's got the 4-star skill moves and a 4-star weak foot so we can perform the 4-star skill moves such as you know the spin, the Berber spin, all those overpowered skill moves. Um, and then as well as that he can also finish on his left foot with his 4-star weak foot. So we get a really nice goal here to finish it off. We do some spins. Do the Giovenco spin past the player to another spin and then go with the low driven finish into the bottom corner past the goalkeeper. So guys, this has been the review. If you have enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching and see you next time.